Hey guys, um, this is going to be a super random video. I haven't done a video like this for a while and I thought it was overdue, so I'm just going to start. I have been seeing this video on Facebook and it's a sponsored video. Um, so it's like an ad and I see it all the time, every time I'm on Facebook, which is a lot. And it's always somebody different and I don't know, it's just like kind of intrigued me. I have been wanting to try one of these for a while. I don't know if this is the one I really wanted to try. I don't really know if there's different ones. Honestly, I haven't even really looked into it other than I did pick this up and I do believe it was like 12 or $13 and it took forever to get to me. Um, I almost did it last night and I said, no, I'm going to wait and do a video on this. I have been using a lot of charcoal products. I even get like the Himalayan charcoal salt. If you haven't tried that, it's really good, but that was really random. I have been using this Bure and my cat wanted in. Such a pain in the ass. I bought this. I kept seeing this toothpaste, this charcoal toothpaste, and I gave in and I fucking ordered it too. So maybe in a couple weeks, it's going to take obviously, I guess, three weeks to get here. Um, maybe I'll do another video. If you guys are even interested, if not, that's fine too. It's a purifying peel off face mask. It says it's smooth skin, deep cleaning, peel off mask, removes dulling surface cells, Impures while vitamins and plant extracts softens the skin to restore youthful glow. Which we all know, the older we get, I need a hell of a lot of youthful glow. So we'll see if this works. I'm only going to use it on my nose and maybe my chin just to try it out. Because I've seen people use it all over their face. And they're like really struggling to get it off. So I don't really want to feel like doing that today. So I'm just going to do my nose and I'm just going to do my chin and see how it works out and if it works out good. Natural Science is the brand that I picked up. It says avoid eyebrows, eyes, and lips. If you decided to do your lips or whatever, want to rip your eyebrows off, they don't recommend that. And peel it off and leave it on for 30 minutes. To achieve better results, apply toner to tighten and cleanse the pores thoroughly. So um, I'm going to do this and this is a 50 milliliter little tube, little container, and um, it's actually a pretty decent size. It You want to put it on, I think, thick. So I put it off long enough. I'm just going to put it on my nose. So um, I'll get closer because I don't want to really go in my bathroom. I go in my bathroom, but my husband has the light hooked up to the fan and it just is a loud hot mess and you go oh, this is like super thick I don't know if you can tell um, how thick it is but I wanted to use a brush I couldn't find like a painter's brush like I really wanted so I said screw it I'm just using my finger so oh my god this is like oh it's so thick it's so it feels like tar it looks like tar. I really hope this works. I feel like, I don't know, weird. I feel like I open my mouth every time. Can you put mascara on without opening your mouth? I tried to do that one time and I can't. It's like I'm not multitasking. There's my cat. He fucking wanted in, now he wants out. Such a brat. Okay. I'm scared to do my chin, guys. This is going to be a Snapchat picture for sure. No filter needed for this. I don't know how thick. How thick to put it on or not. Like, I want to make sure it doesn't get stuck there. It's not runny, so you're not going to have to worry about that. I will see you in about 30 minutes. Right now, I'm going to try to rinse this off my finger. And I will see you in 30 minutes. Okay. Oh, I didn't realize how tight. I realized I didn't know how tight it was until I started talking. Oh, this is not going to come off. Okay, so I waited 30 minutes. And I don't know how to pull this off. I'll get closer. Fuck.
Now that hurt. Oh, but it's really smooth. Oh, this one's gonna hurt worse. Oh. Fuck, I go. This one's almost not dry yet. I waited 30 minutes. I don't know if it's better to pull it fast or slow. And it pretty much peeled off. I obviously have some spots. Look, I'm gonna make a mess. It actually peeled off a lot easier than what I thought. Um, I thought it was gonna really struggle. My first time using it. So I don't really know if it will get better throughout time or using it. It did really work. It pulled a lot of my um, blackheads out. I know I had some on my nose. It has to pull something out because that just gets so hard and it's it's gonna pull something out. So I mean, I'm gonna go rinse my face because this isn't cute.